everybody, just wanted to do a quick product review. Um, Core Coaster uh, or Core Prodigy sent me uh, this cool product called Core, a Core Coaster. So what I want you to know is one of the things, if you know anything about me, I love progressions. So being able to take something and be able to have something where you can start pretty much any athlete on and then progress them on and make it a little bit more advanced. Um, this is an awesome product, at least from what I've seen so far. Number one, the construction is awesome. Really hard plastic. Uh, the wheels, I think, better than an ab dolly where they're not plastic, they're actually um, almost, almost like a rubber. Uh, if you get in here close, you can see even the steel construction around. Uh, everything seems to be on there really, really good. Uh, haven't had any issues with them. And when you get them, you get two core coasters and then you get a, a mat to go along with it. So if you're going on your knees, you're not to the point where you're off of your knees yet, then you have a soft surface to really put those down on so it's not uncomfortable. What you'll also notice is there's a small slit or a small hole in the core coaster itself. So, and there's a band that typically comes with it that you can basically put through there and then hook onto the inside so it's not gonna come out. So what does this do? So ultimately this is going to aid in you going through some of the movements that most people are gonna go through with a core coaster where you're reaching out overhead um, and allows you to kind of pull back in. And obviously the progression is going to be to get to a point where you're off your knees and going without the band. But even with this, we've gone through where this is a little bit too difficult for some of our kids so what we started to do was take some jump stretch bands. So this is a Monster Mini. It will fit through there. It's a little bit tight, but if you finesse it through, it'll grab on in there the same way the other bands will, right behind the back. And then just make sure it's snug, right? So for me, I always like to loop something on, so at this point, it's on, it's on the core coaster. I'm gonna loop that around my foot just one time so that I feel it's not gonna come off of there. So now we just went through with the Monster Mini. So from there, you can basically go down to a mini band and hook it through the same way. And then obviously, you could end up with one of these at the end, not as much tension. Obviously, you're moving from as much help as possible to as little help as possible until you get to a point where you don't have any band at all. Obviously, you have one. Well, what would the next progression be? Add another one. So instead of reaching out with one hand, you can reach out simultaneously. And now you can start going through. All kinds of different movements, whether it be on your hands or whether it be on your feet. So I think that it just gives you a little bit more versatility. Obviously, being creative and figuring out new ways to challenge someone is a goal as long as you can progress it in the appropriate